Welcome to Just a Minute, a look back at the Seahawks' last game, their road win over the Falcons. This was a game the Seahawks had a little to gain and a lot to lose. Building up a 24-point lead on the road, usually a good way to win, and it was. Despite being 6-2, and two, obviously still a work in progress on defense, but I think all signs are pointing up. Worth noting, their secondary was without Trey Flowers, who we know is important, and Quandre Driggs, who we think will be important. Marquise Blair can be a huge factor, and Jaron Reed should be more effective the more he plays. This may be important because the offensive line depth is going to be under pressure for the second half of the season. Britt is gone. Expect Yapati and Fluker to miss more time. The O-line was a key part of the first half success, and it may struggle in the second half. Well, I'm already looking past Tampa Bay next week. Monday the 11th should be the rekindling of the rivalry with San Francisco. Now, I know Pete Carroll and company take things one week at a time, but Graz's big head does not. And that's just a minute for this week, Seahawks fans.